Okay, but uh, go in the computer, it'll give us the beginning blueprints for wood buildings. <clears throat> if you want to follow the plot, you can probably do that on somebody else's video. All right, we learned seven items. Notice on the right hand side of the screen it says floor panels one. Let's stick the floor panel. I got plenty of wood. I spent a little time gathering stuff. I'm gonna stick it right over the copper um, here. This isn't a very good copper model. Now look, it says three walls. So you hit C, click the wall, and we'll do three on this side because well just because and build a roof notice it takes ferrite dust also and we have shelter build a timber timber door notice it requires a 25 carbon and 10 pure ferrite so if you don't have pure ferrite, you're going to have to use this time to make it. All right. Computer hmm. Let's see. Let's move the computer, actually, into the building. So the way you do that is you do Z, C, left click on the computer. We'll put it in a corner in the building. All right, now let's access the computer while we're not in the storm. It gives you plans for a construction unit. One carbon nanotube and 20 magnetized ferrite. Okay, so to make the magnetized ferrite, put your refiner down. Now we need um, 40 pure ferrite to make that. So go in here. Uh, let's just... So using the mouse wheel, I set it to 40. Technology recharge. Now we need carbon nanotubes. And uh, let's make the, cons let's hit G and let's make the color, um, do they have, brown since we're in wood that will kind of match or uh, what is kind of hmm let's do black Stone clearing. and but let's do wood and in fact Incoming for the storm. base computer let's do uh, Z C G. Let's change that to wood and let's do uh, gray and black for that too. Now that looks a little different for a base computer, but these two match. I think the gray and black looks good in the wood. Okay, now I gathered 12 salvage data. I couldn't remember how much I'd need, but I figured 12 would be enough.
Okay, research buildable technology. You need a base teleport module. <clears throat> you need the biofuel reactor. Um, you get the wiring for free. Now we have nine data left. What else do they have here? I'm going to save that for now. So let's put that on the ship. Okay, so we need to power... Uh, let's change this around a little bit. So, let's extend the floor. Let's move this wall here. Now, let's start changing... Um, Extend the wall, but let's start making. Yeah, let's li we'll leave the walls as wood. Okay, we'll add the more roof. Doesn't work from this angle. Traveler. <sighs> System one. Now this planet should send us to the space station now. Repeating 16 from the space station. Talk to the first guy here. Ask. I repeat, sixteen. 
We are watching you, traveler friend. Find what we have left you. So I get a string of code. And maybe the base computer will be able to figure it out. Now it wants me to visit technology merchants to upgrade ship and equipment, the cartographer for directions to outposts and other buildings, missions from the mission agent to earn valuable rewards, and the teleporter to return to the base. Let's see, first, what is this guy doing? I like making squares, but you know what? We'll finish off rows here, and we'll finish off rows up here. Maybe every two rows down here, we'll do one row up here. Now, how much nanites do I have? No. I am in the building. My ship should be nearby somewhere. Hit escape, go to your options, go to network. Now, can join my group? Uh, well, I'll do invite only. PVP, no one. Uh, no one, no one. Um, no one. No one. Okay, so that's a little safer. If you want, you could also set on difficulty your damage to zero. But I don't like changing the difficulty settings. Um, I can explain that why some other time. I just like leaving it on standard. It seems to mess up stuff with the anomaly to me. I could be wrong though. All right, it says visit your base computer. Begin decryption. Give them the data from the space station. The 16's repeating. Warp drive plans now, but we only have 36,700 units. Our first money maker will just be to search this wreckage. get the blueprint for a hyperdrive. Okay, it's going to want us to build that, but first, in these, go grab the stuff in there. Ten slots on my suit. Oh, 
Oh yeah, you gotta get out of that area. Radiation protection falling. Radiation okay, now that salvage frigate module that we got is worth 95,000 units. By the way, the goop, that's 10,000, and the slime is worth uh, 2,800. Okay, to install, you left click, left click. We need 125 chromatic metal, which means 250 copper, and five microprocessors. We have enough copper, so let's do that now. We said 250, a little bit more is fine. You can always use more chromatic metal. Now it says we need 137,500. Um, so that's about, what, 21,000 more. First of all, let's move this to the spaceship. These can be processed to nanites in the long run, but for now, I'm not going to spend the time or the energy to do that. I'm not going to have a frigate for a while, so actually, I don't see why I would need that. And that puts me over right there. five of these. It's like half the money I have. Okay, and the hyperdrive is installed. Alright, give the computer a minute to catch up. It opened up this guy yet. Oh yeah, he's got missions now. All right, let's follow what it says. Return to ship. Find hyperdrive. Interesting to look. 
look at this planet, so... Let's shoot ten of these. To, just to get I suspect it's we're going to that building there. So let's just land here. If you want to see what I got, I got the gold nugget, I got two of the clusters which add tritium. And uh, 413 should be enough for a little while. If you hit F, you see the thing is right inside there. But let's grab the technology. So notice the device reveals a single blinking, unblinking crimson eye. That crimson eye will come up. You will find us when the time is right. careful because you can take damage from some things in here. Mostly hanging down poses. Well, I think we're done in here. And now to fuel the hyperdrive, so we left click and drag and drop. All right. Now, the system we're currently in is a GEC system. So when we go to another system, I would like either Viking or Corvax. Okay, so it wants us to warp to another system. So it's Corvax, so let's go ahead and accept that as an option. Let's go to the space station first. Well, we'll go to the space station first before we follow this.
what kind of Since this is here, why not? Yep. Is it traveler? Is it friend? Notice the crimson eye. So both have seen the eye and the eye has seen him. And he gets a warp cell. Three of four fauna, one flying. Okay, let's refill the drive. Let's go to, we've got. We've got a Gex system, and we've got a Corvax system. Let's go to a bike's bike. New mission available. Let's go to a Viking. Try this one. Same stuff. Incoming mess. X. Identify yourself. I don't understand. Let's get another. Let's get another equipment slot. Let's 
plants at the multi tool. Dude, we have at least 100 nanites. Let's do this. Life form again. And I give him a hundred nanites. Now we have two things to do. Let's head to the unknown grave. Go to catalog, collected knowledge, atlas, portal glyphs. You'll have the first glyph view. You get one glyph to each of these graves that you visit. stuff while we're here. So we need more. Right, is used as a type of food. Um, I believe. 
leave in place of Tritium. And you need it to um, grow certain plants. A certain memory fragment came from the alien at the grave. Starship have some fuel, yes. I should probably add blast
you get is the name Artemis. And you need that advanced mining laser. there's at least 25%. Shield down. I'm gonna dismantle this to get the wiring loom, I think. Instead of repair it. Hermetic seal and metal plate. Remember, you got their medic seal diagram at the beginning of the game. And we have pure ferrite in that hydrogen jelly. Now let's fly this to the space station. We'll ignore the anomaly. We'll sell this. Get the radiant pillar and then get on the anomaly. And then I'm going to do a live stream for the um, Omega Expedition. I'm going to see if I can do that, do the Omega Expedition like a speed run later today. See how many hours it takes to do. do the Omega Expedition thing anyway. Alright, let's answer it outside because the anomaly will appear in front of you. Call me Artemis, but I'm not Artemis. With the and he's with the is it first, is it last thing. I tell the truth. Why lie? And now we have access to the anomaly, which means we should also have access to the Omega. Questline. Uh, expedition. But I would talk to Nada first and be sure um, be 
sure you get the Artemis thing. Artemis up here. So I believe we'll have the Artemis quest when we finish. So I'm going to end the episode here. And the next episode we will pick up also on here. And I will go and try and start the Omega Expedition with a live stream and we'll take this new guy through the Omega Expedition. How does that sound? So I'll see you all in an hour or two for the Omega Expedition. Thank you for watching.